done. Today is Saturday the 10th of August and it is a beautiful sunny day outside. I'm about to head out to do some shopping. Now what's the time Archie? It is 10 to 10 and uh, we better get moving. Now today is a little bit different. I've decided to sign up to a company here in Australia called HelloFresh. Now it's really basic. All they do, excuse me, they offer an online portal and uh, what you do is you log in online, you create an account and you tell them how many people you'd like to feed and for how many days and what kind of meals they can do, breakfast, lunch and dinners. So what I did is I jumped online and I chose to do three meals for the week because Monday, Tuesday we cook at home and Thursday and normally Wednesday I'm out. Uh, we eat out on a Wednesday night after WW and well Friday's just a whatever you want to eat day right so I've ordered three meals and I scheduled it to arrive this morning at seven I have unpacked it and I'll pop that video in here as well obviously when it came I wanted to unpack it straight away because I've got cold products in there and I will show you what we've got and I'll just vlog a little of what we're doing for today nothing too exciting nothing too crazy for this weekend but um yeah today I thought I would try something different do you guys want to check out my jacket? Here is a what I'm wearing today. I've got a Rolling Stones t-shirt, just some Freddie jeans, and of course, my jacket. But anyway guys, I've got to get going. We've got heaps to do, so uh, I'll catch you all again real soon. Alrighty, so here is my HelloFresh delivery. Let's take a look. Okay. Just a couple of little pamphlets to get you started. Oh, here is our meal plan for the week. Okay, that's right. So I got American Spiced Pork Steaks, uh, Cheats Beef and Corn Enchiladas, Chicken and Creamy Chive Sauce. Okay, so that looks really good. Now for these three meals for four adults was a uh, hundred and nine dollars with delivery. So meal kit yellow. Oh, okay. So each meal kit. Ah, so there's. I can see at the bottom of this one. This is the American spice pork is yellow, and I'm assuming yellow is the uh, the marry up. I'm just going to have a quick look at what's in this parcel. I'm going to put these on the floor. Okay, so we have a green, a blue and a yellow parcel. And I'm assuming this is our cold products inside this freezer bag that we have here. So for, let's do yellow. For the yellow bag, we have a bag of baby spinach, <laughs> some chives, uh, some almonds, a capsicum, uh, one piece of corn, supposed to probably cut that up between four people I don't know I'd have to read the recipe um, spice blend obviously for the pork two carrots and four potatoes so I guess these are the vegetable components for this meal and in here I'm assuming I'm going to find some pork. Oh, and some sauces. Okay, so here are the sauces. Oh, everything's frozen, which is great. Cooking creamy. Okay, so this must be... Archie's trying to get in on the action here. Pork loins. There's two in there. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Excuse me, those carrots are not for 
you, mister. Up. Thank you. I don't know, I'm trying to steal my food. All right, so we have chicken, beef. Huh, okay. Pork loins. There must be four in there. Well, it's 600 grams, so I'm assuming there's four in that packet. All right, look at this mess you've made, Archie. Your carrots. You've had breakfast. Anyway, so this is pretty, hey, hey, this is pretty easy. Excuse me. They're telling me it's 25 minutes to prepare and ready in 40. So that's really good. And it looks fairly straightforward and easy to make. Excuse me. Up. Oh, thank you. So very straightforward to make. I will have to work out the points value for every single one of these meals that we make. But overall, I think not too bad. This creamy chicken and chives. I think this one looks really yummy. So that is the green bag. And obviously for this bag, we have got chicken, which again is, oh, it's almost a kilo. So that could probably do all of us, depending how hungry the boys were. Now in this bag we've got some chives. Spare me, that's really hardly any. Some green beans. Two zucchinis. Four potatoes. Two large cloves of garlic. And one little teeny weeny baby sock. Okay, um, I don't think one potato is going to be enough for my boys. So I'm probably going to have to add more potatoes to this meal. And I'll probably add some mushrooms perhaps. I don't know. We'll see how we go. So at this stage, I think it's really convenient. And um, for somebody like me who's been working a lot lately, it might be just really quick and convenient to come home, grab my bag, whack it all together. But cost-wise, is it um, worth the dollars you pay? That I'm not convinced at this stage. Um, what I'll do is I'll probably do a price comparison and I could probably have picked all of this stuff up for like 80 bucks maybe. So... I don't know, it depends what's more important, convenience or the cash. But anyway, I'm not disappointed. I think it's pretty good. I think maybe the serving sizes that they've, um, like, not the serving sizes, but let's say the meat portions as such, I don't think is that fantastic. I think they could have, you know, at least gone to the kilo instead of just under a kilo for the, for the chicken, let's say. But, like I said, I'm not mad. Um, I was keen to try it. I'm going to obviously head out and have to buy some extra stuff for lunches and whatnot. Anyway, this was purely just meals. But, yeah, overall, at this stage, I think I'm pretty happy.
very tiny, tiny grocery haul for this week. So I needed some paper towels. I got some Nutrigan for my son, grapes. I needed some more uh, sweetener, some protein milk for myself, a large milk for the family. I got some tuna and oil, which I'm gonna have with some rice for lunches, some baby peppers or capsicums for snacks, uh, some meatballs for my son's lunch and some frankfurts some roll-ups and some Nutri-Grain bars for my son's lunch, some bread, some gluten-free pulse pasta. This is so good. Um, I got some strawberries, blueberries. Um, you might notice these little pink and white mini marshmallows. These taste so good. What I like to do is just take 25 grams, which is two points, and put them in my yogurt. So yummy. Some little carrot sticks for snacks mozzarella cheese and of course I picked up a corn silver side which I'm going to whack into my slow cooker this week and of course some watermelon now the watermelon and the grapes cost me a bomb my camera died halfway through that conversation but I was saying that these a little bag of grapes yes this little bag here was almost $11 now if I didn't love grapes so much I would not pay that but they are at a premium right now because of the season um, and I just needed my grapes. I haven't had them for a while so I really needed some. They were worth it but uh, yeah, pretty pricey for this week. But anyway, that is it 